has got his own repertoire of wins, not only see Caleb that he took earlier on stream, Ooh, but also okay. he has uh, his wins on players like Zenyu and Marvelous Marco. So quite the force, and yet another Falco comes into the into the city, and let's see if he can go toe to toe and put on just as quite a show as Tilde can. Yeah, it sounds like we're seeing uh, two players coming in with some hot bracket momentum right now, and. One thing I know about Falco is he loves having momentum. Oh yeah, he. This man is putting on the Windows Movie Maker and saying, "Yeah, this is. <laughs> these combos <laughs> can last a while, which make can almost make the tempo of a match and that momentum feel really awkward to to play into, because you're just getting comboed for much longer than many other characters in this game." So you don't get to reset to neutral, which is where Diddy is at his strongest. Right. Ooh. That was a oh. sick banana conversion. <laughs> that was so clean. <laughs> Gotta love the down, using Diddy's banana against him. Like it's, it's still a phenomenal item, even outside of the hands of the the man who spawned it or the monkey that did. And not to mention Falco's own reflector coming out frame one. The hitbox isn't frame one, but that reflector box is frame one, being able to very well antagonize the use of the banana from Slingshot as this is starting to snowball real quick. It really is. Ooh, this, okay. Nexus decided to take the high road and make it back to stage uh, before committing to any edge guards. And Slingshot's gonna be fine in uh, his first stock on Nexus. It just immediately getting put right back off stage. All right. Ooh. Tucking away, but he again not trying to give Slingshot the space to pull banana in the space that Diddy wants to play at. He's like, all right, if you're gonna monkey flip, I'm gonna follow you. I'm gonna follow you with Falco monkey flip. <laughs> the, <laughs> the phantasm, super quick, especially after these short hops. Slingshot wanted that space. Nexus was not giving it to him right there, just as you were saying. <laughs> he can't get any banana things started. Yeah, gotta gotta utilize Diddy's own tools and Diddy. It, I mean, no stranger and no slouch in scramble situations, but it just looks like Nexus is playing one step ahead, kind of figuring what Slingshot wants to do, and that landing hitbox comes in super clutch, even finding the kill off of the uh, off the drop shield from Slingshot. Just didn't expect for that to go to as sour as it really starts to continue. 49, like it's nothing. I really think Slingshot has not gotten a single banana in his favor this whole game. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Hey. He did it. <laughs> A round of applause. <laughs> oh, that laser extension was super clean, forcing uh, yet again Slingshot to for find a new way to get out of disadvantage. Yet that F tilt. Is he going to go for again? I thought, oh, there we go. Nice. I thought the banana was going to uh, get Slingshot out of his jetpack, and I my heart stopped. <laughs> <laughs> you know, there's been plenty of heart-stopping moments from Nexus thus far. He's been playing this extraordinarily well. The Ooh. down toe on the legend vulnerability That's missing. That's going to be a dead ditty. Uh, oh, man, the fast fall as well. The quickest of fast falls before coming out with that double jump aerial. Falco's double jump. Mm -hmm. uh, incredible, to say the least. Absolutely. All right. But what this is that first stock. Ooh. Mm, very nice, very nice. Good. What do you think Slingshot should be adapting to as far as, uh, you know, next game? Because really, Slingshot just could not get uh, his banana neutral going as he wanted to. Nexus was on top of almost every single banana. I feel like he needs to feed into uh, the tempo that Nexus is doing. Not in the same, not in the sense of like force your way in and just trying to play to Nexus's strengths. Because that's obviously not what you. Oh, what a mash! <laughs> obviously, not what you want to do. But if Nexus wants to put you in scramble situations without the banana, then let Diddy's aerials do the talking. Mm -hmm. Diddy's got an amazing array of these quick aerial buttons that can contest even characters like Falco and Fox, all the spaces that are known for their close quarters combat. Diddy Kong can contest that and more. So maybe you don't need to pull banana as often if you're willing to just scrap, like mm -hmm. we are seeing in this game too. Just. Hit after hit, going toe to toe, blow to blow. Mm -hmm. And we've been seeing it so far. And once again, Nexus coming up with the reflector. You know, slingshots off stage. That's going to be a big punish. Nice patience by Slingshot, waiting out that uh, F smash. And yeah, now he's got banana in hand. And now with a stock up, you can start playing to banana's strengths as Nexus has to 
almost force his way in and force Falco's kill confirms and combos a little bit. Finding the empty hop grab, looking for the uh, back air, but a good jump away from the slingshot as the banana that comes was a, in clutch. <laughs> that was the longest banana confirm I've ever seen. Yeah, jumping away and falling with that fair. He's covering himself with hitboxes super well and forcing Nexus to just reconsider how he wants to go about his offense. Down tilt, grab banana. Doesn't get the Z drop though. Clean go. stuff from Nexus to get off the ledge. And get that kill. Yeah, nice anti air up smash. You know, the classic Falco up smash just significantly better than it was before and for good reason. Yeah, that, that Diddy F smash has been doing it for uh, decades at this point it and has. it's still so strong. I really like the use of uh, Nexus using these Phantasms, uh, not just as the classic movement option, but just getting over the banana that's uh, on the ground. Uh, still just showing that he can still play around these uh, bananas pretty well. Uh, finding that laser off of ledge, Nexus starting to do a starting to find something together, but once you're out of the bread and butter range, sometimes Falco can have some trouble, yet that falling there is such a clean starter. He needs to find this kill off the interaction, but Monkey Foot gets him out of danger, only to find yet another up smash. These perfect anti from Nexus have been amazingly clutch in the latter half of this game, too. All right. Just running into an F smash. Okay. <laughs> sometimes it works. <laughs> one, one reversal, I guess. Oh my god. About an even game right now. Uh, Slingshot has... Oh not been able to play the game since he spawned. What a comeback by Nexus with the pop-off, a well-earned pop-off. Yeah, he got, he got up smashed, and then said, "Okay, uh, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna drop anything this stock. I'm mm -hmm. gonna find my I'm gonna find my conversions, because frequently slingshot." What he was doing a little bit too early was jumping out of disadvantage. And while at higher percents against Falco, that's what you want to do. You don't want to give him the 50-50s the off of air dodge or let him try and frame trap you. At low percents and especially on shield, jumping out of shield against Falco is almost a death sentence. Absolutely. And, I mean, case in point. <laughs> Clean stuff from Nexus, though, as he fights his way into Winterside Top 24. And right off the bat, we're going to be getting the next two players. All right. And we're looking at Zamba versus X in our next uh, pools.